So here, as you can see, I have an element 3D model and it's a billboard sign right here. So right now, the default light is being selected and that's a single light. And you can see that there are many lighting presets that you can choose from right here. So you can select something like clean blue. You can select something like basic, as you can see, which really bumps up the lighting right there. You can also work with underground, um, underwater, that, uh, that gives an underwater look to the lighting, the bluest look. You can give a natural lighting setting, some dramatic lighting, as you can see, sunset lighting, and so forth. So your red lighting is also there. So let us choose um, aqua, which gives it a bluish tone. So I'm going to choose this lighting and this is what I want. So now I'm going to select this and I'm going to press OK. And notice that the model is there. I'm going to uh, rotate this model out a bit by going on to group right here. And I'm going to just rotate this out, rotate this model out right here, right? Just rotate it to see how that model looks. All right. So you can see that uh, the lighting is back to natural. So I don't have that underwater look right there onto the model right there. So what I can do is I can enable the lighting setup by going on to the render setting right here and I can go under lighting. So you can see that right now the use comp light is on and there's also add lighting right here. So I can go over here and you can see that the similar option is actually available so you can go for single right light right here which is the default the clean blue light you can see that the lighting change right there you can go for the warm light you can go for a spot you can go for aqua the one that we chose right there and once we uh, um, once we actually go for rotation you can see that there's a bluish tint over there just like that as you can see there's the blue tint right there with the reflection so let us go over here into the render setting right here there's aqua there's spot blue there's uh, sun and there's sunset right here for the warm type of tone right there so you can see that this is how you can work with the light settings and besides this you can also use after effects lights so you can right click here go to new and go to light right here and once you go to light you can select different type of lights like spotlight press ok and the spotlight has been added right there and you can work with after effects lights right here as well just like that so that is how you can use the lighting presets and you and also work with some lights in after effects so uh, in element 3d so if you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe